you right. I'm not too familiar with this matchup. Is it bad for Mewtwo? Um, Falcon has guaranteed down throw knee, but Mewtwo also has the combo game similar to uh, Zelda, so it's a lot of combos. All right. But Falcon has better punishes than Mewtwo does. True. They're going on Dreamland. Um, right. I guess uh, Mewtwo doesn't kill off the sides. You know, like, he kills off the side with like back, with back air, like back throw, back air, just follow him and float. Yeah, he's not going to get too many easy up throws, though. Yeah, he's not, no. He's not going to kill him up high, so that's why Nevergreen picked the stage. Also because Knee kills on the side really early, despite being huge as hell. Yeah. Like, down throw guarantees and oh, everything. Ooh. That was up to... Triple so, up to Triple okay. up air into Knee. Like, if, you just, if he eats his jump, he's forced to teleport. Like, he has no... Uh, when Mewtwo flashes, like, when you see, like, lines, that means he burned his double jump. Yeah. That's after a teleport, no ooh. matter what happens. Shield stab. Forward throw? He's gonna do a turnaround back air. Yeah. Yep. Those double jump cancel back airs. Ne Alright, Nevergreen trying to get for the pivot pound smash. The trademark staple of Nevergreen. Jump so like in right, there. Right jump now, in there. He's jump just trying there. to poke him with jump a nair, there. trying to gain stage control. That that would have that would have been a stock actually. If back uh, air? if Rob let go of ledge and back air, that would have been a Nevergreen stock. Nice down Ooh. air. Uh, Rob getting the crouch cancel and not doing anything about it. Ooh. Side B does grab ledge now in this game, which is really, really helpful for Captain Falcon. Absolutely. Because in melee, he just dies. Ooh, did you see that cute little uh, shenanigans? He did double jump, wall wall jump, and then up beats. Try to get the extra height to grab, the, grab him with the Falcon kiss. All right, just jump in there. All right. Um, I want Rob to... to um, not jump in and there. I, I think they're both going to. It's all they're doing. See, like, high stage, that's a back air. Oh, oh man. You two not over 99%. Uh, Captain Falcon's going to come back because his recovery is actually a little fast. Nope, See, yeah, it's Dreamland. Definitely not. All right, all now right, he's maybe, dead. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You got the reverse hit of the up air, which is not the move you want to be killing off the side with. Not particularly. I All mean, right. see, down throw me, it's almost guaranteed on this character. Especially with the, the fair nerf. Fair is now 7 frames instead of 6. Is it? Yeah, like, you, on paper, it's like, oh, whatever, it's 1 frame, who cares? Uh, no, that means that it loses now to moves. You too, cares. I mean, he has better options than fair. He could, like, teleport, he could, like, air dodge. He could do anything else besides fair. Yeah, Mewtwo's air dodge can be deadly sometimes because you can't tell exactly yeah, where like he's right going. Yeah, like right. That was nice. That was nice. Uh, Rob knew that Nevergreen was gonna go for the ledge, so he did up B from the middle of the stage and just snap ledge. That was good. All right. Oh, oh my God. no way. That would have been a nice uh, little gimp right there. Yeah. Yo, Nair teleport is ridiculous. Oh. Oh no. no. It's alright, he was at 120% anyway, so it's not that bad. Everybody Wispy Woods one taking the stock for that one. Alright, I would actually would have gone for another back air. Like, no, no, no. He's no? Right now he's racking up damage. Wow. Like, going for back air is good, but then you gain stage control, but you want to build, you want to be building up damage at this percent. Alright. And then going for, like, the easy kill. Oh, like, oh. like... That was all up a nipple spike on the stage. Ooh, nice spot dodge, knowing that Nevergreen was going to do that. Falcon kick? Ooh, that side B was oh. questionable. The side B increased his momentum going up, but what happened was he lost all horizontal and only went uh, vertical, which didn't really help. Yeah. Nevergreen counterpicking with uh, re uh, Vanilla Falcon instead of, uh, you know, original NES, whatever that was, 64 Falcon. Yeah. I don't know. I never played uh, F-Zero. What's wrong with you? I... I'm, I don't know. A lot of things, apparently. I mean, Bowser, so... Yeah, that, that's one thing for sure. And I'm going to Olympus as Bowser. I do. Why would you do that? Why wouldn't you? I mean, I might actually. I might money match people with my Bowser. Yo, we see a Roy coming out. What? Got Captain Falcon versus Roy right now. Um, This matchup is a lot of spaghetti to me. I, I want to say it's in Roy's favor. Roy has the combo game and the tools to be Captain Falcon. Easy Falcon, ledge guards, maybe? A little bit easier. Down tilt? The, now, um, he doesn't have to worry about getting down throw to uh, need now. Absolutely. He also has a bigger disjoint than Mewtwo does, besides his tail. That's a stop. Yeah. 
Uh, we're going to see a lot of that. Yeah, like, Rob has to go for more of those. He doesn't have a double jump. Pump makes it back because fire, fire up is really solid. Right. Ooh. We living. Um, Roy's grab range is also longer than Mewtwo, so that he, is, he should be going for more shield grabs. But the reverse smack of Falcon Kick. Nargreen missing the edge, uh, the edge guard, just letting him come back for free. He's just a couple of those. So yeah. Alright. Alright. Um, throw knee is now a thing. Is it a down throw knee? Roy's counter is. I Jab reset. I think Roy's is slower than Mark's for sure, which means that he can't, like, try to spam counter. Alright, that was a good fire blade. Coming down. Okay, nice what is safe. going on there? La spaghetti. Told you, that's what the set's gonna be. Spaghetti. And me. This tech into me. True combo. Ooh, mistimed the fire blade. Would have got a clean smack from that. Nevergreen, uh, yeah, just, pivot falcon. Uh, just pivot. slapping the C stick around. I know, dude. I saw forward smash and I was like, wait, that's the wrong direction. Ooh, reading the tech in Great place. Movement. All right, even game right now, this is definitely looking a lot better than game one, dude. And now Rob is the lead for the first time in the set. Very close, Albate. Yeah. I'm surprised he's not going for the... Because there's a reverse hit on, uh, on Roy's side. Oh, oh no. That's it's two SDs. Yeah. Both at the same time. Second stop. Second to last stop of each match SD. If he plays it safe enough and doesn't get grabbed, he's got it. Yeah, he's fine. Ooh, went in the, that uh, forward tilt a little too high. Could have oh, actually uh, sniped him. There. Grab? Up throw? No, we're going to go for the down throw. He's taking stabs in the dark. No, nah, he's playing it safe. Down throw? He's trying to... Ooh. All right. Nah, we living. We living. Ooh, nice oh side beat God. into back, back air. air. Wow. With great yeah. DI from Nevergreen. Could be because Rob missed the sweet spot. He got like the there's like there's like a really strong sweet spot, and then there's a there's like normal sweet spot. Yeah. Not the normal sweet spot. Nah, Captain Falcon's up smash. I never see it hit anybody. I will make sure that hits someone by the end of tonight. You play Captain Falcon? I'm playing Captain Falcon tonight. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, oh. oh! On that. You tried set. to come back. You tried to gimp Nevergreen in the process, but Roy's ledge grab game is not like it's not like strong as like Luigi's or like. I'm trying to think someone who has like, like game watch. Game watch can grab the ledge from like this far away. Yeah. Luigi's floating enough where he like can up B and he can drift towards the ledge. Magnet hands. Yeah.